Hey everybody, Dr. Pancake Face here, and we are back with some more Time Machine VR. Okay, so in the last episode, uh, we had just gotten done um, checking out the uh, big alligator guy. Um, so we are going to go over here, check out this uh, thingy thing here, scan some stuff, do some things. It's going to be good. It's going to be cool. All right. Oh my god, I have to get my battle gear on. <laughs> okay. So. Get all the fucking cords out of the way. Jesus Christ. Alright. Recenter my view. <laughs> fucking love this thing. Oh man. Alright. Let's go. Oh, I'm itching. Yay, get to go over to this thing. That's where I wanted to go in the last episode. Okay, so... You are going to need to get up to speed quickly now. Alright. The Dynadex can help with that. Gotcha. It's where we save all our research Ooh. and the data we collect. <laughs> it can help you learn more about the creatures we've encountered. Just line yourself up with the pod hologram to attach to the structure. Oh, cool. Ooh. Neato. Alright. Um, oh, shitty. Look at 30%. Oh, wow. Look at all these question marks. Holy crap, look at that. It's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Is there any other ones? Oh, my God. Where were we? Oh, yes. Your next assignment is more than ready. Feel free, Shit. though, to take a moment to rest before heading out again. I want to go back into that. I want to see what I missed. Okay. Oh, my God, my view. Let's go into you. Let's check you out. So, what did, what did we learn? Um... General, temporal range, mid to late Jurassic, average size 43 feet. Woo, you're a big fella. The brain, ah! High metabolism with body temperature, negative 10 degrees Celsius above the surroundings. Um, negative 10 degrees Celsius above the surroundings? That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Highly visual predator. Uh, required adept light to see prey effectively. Cool! Sure, we'll look at that. Gave live birth at sea to individual pups. Cool! I learned a little bit about you. Oh, you had the bony eyes. So you could dive deeper. I remember that. You are one freaky looking motherfucker. Why do you have so many teeth? Fuck okay, it, let's get out of here. Where's the next assignment? Recenter again. Alright. Um. Aha! There it is. Whoa! That that gave me made me a little bit dizzy. <laughs> is there like a sprint? Is there a faster button? Nope. That's it. That's about, that's as fast as we go. I've hit all the buttons. And let's go. All systems are now online and operational. Prepare for temporal relocation in three, two, Ooh, one. Ooh, here we go. Time for some time travel. Weren't these things going the other way around last time? I don't know. Maybe they weren't. Oh, that makes me dizzy. 
can't, can't do that. <laughs> That is not a good thing. Oh, back into this. All right. Woof. Talk about strobe lights. Let's review our objectives. Okay. Our primary oh, research target for this excursion is the Dacosaurus. It's so well adapted to life at sea, we're not sure it ever leaves the water. Why are we As going the up virus this scary the doctor shit? described originated in water, we hope Dacosaurus may offer us some insight. The area we're investigating Man. was recently hit by violent tremors. Earthquakes and tsunamis were the norm in the late Jurassic period. We've arrived. When you're ready, focus your view on the shutter controls. Let's continue our mission. All right, let's do it. Booyah. I am detecting heat signatures at dangerously high levels all around us. Uh, do be careful. Okay. Oh, man. Is that the bottom? That is the bottom. Okay. Woo. That at least gives me some sort of bearings. I don't know. <laughs> Makes me feel a little bit better. Let's go along the bottom. Ooh, look at this. Oh, hell yeah. Ooh. Go up the edge of this guy. It's like an underwater volcano or something. Those look quite a bit like our modern nautiluses. Observe the soft cephalopod body emerging from the buoyant shell. Since we're here, why not tag one with a probe so we can identify which genus this is? Can I get close to one? I want to get close to one. I want to take a look. Oh, look at this! Oh, these things are so cool. Okay, um, so I need, whoops, I need that. While Titanites are fascinating, they are not our core objective. Ah, there Let's they are. find a Dacosaurus. Yeah, yeah, let's go for the scary shit. And this game's fucking awesome. Come on, turn. Oh. Off center again. <laughs> Watch that geyser. Pressurized water superheated by magma. Oh. Not hot enough to harm our pod, but it could make navigation challenging. Well, at least it won't hurt me. That's a good thing. Who? <laughs> Dicks! They even put jump scares into this game. Okay, so how do we not get eaten by those things? Huh. Okay, hopefully it won't eat me. Dacosaurus. Fortunate for us, they are focused on a massive carcass. Their behavior is unexpected. Since we're in no danger, Let's try to identify the carcass. Scan all exposed flesh to collect DNA data. So, okay, well. So we're not in danger. That's what you're saying. Okay. Good. I hope you're right. <laughs> so we need the scanner. Oh, nope, I want that. Yes. The big fella. All right. And this 
a lot more violent than the movie Land Before Time, isn't it? <laughs> Fantastic! A nice. Titan, A large land dinosaur of the order Sauropoda. Something of a land whale, so to speak. Decomposition leading to internal gases are responsible for the exposed chest cavity. I estimate it died within the past three weeks. Hmm. Perhaps the earthquake is responsible. Or perhaps the doctor's virus. We should tag all the Dacosauruses with probes. Ah, okay. Probe. I gotta get that one. Aha! Got it. Is that it? How many of them are left? Oh, don't attack me! <laughs> Holy crap! That is one scary-looking fish. Dacosaurus DNA confirmed. Oh, he's coming Good out. Good job. Okay, Let's do a more <laughs> thorough analysis of their biology. Perform a scan on a Dacosaurus. So I need that. All right, come here. Let's go ahead and get a quick little scan of you, buddy. Preliminary analysis indicates that they are not a pack. Ooh. The largest one is male, and the rest are female. Powerful jaws and serrated teeth. Oh, Their man. metabolism seems to be struggling, however. We need to know more about their behavior. Dacosauruses are infamous for being territorial and aggressive. Predators attack if they feel threatened or Whoa. hungry. <laughs> Our pod typically elicits some kind of aggressive response. But they seem to be ignoring us. I suggest Thank you perform God. an echography scan on the stomach of the largest Dacosaurus. Where is he at? That one? Alright. Whoops. <laughs> Keep hitting the wrong button. All right, come here. Don't, don't eat me. Ooh, hey, what's up? There's the answer. The Dacosaurus stomach you scanned is filled to the brim with meat and rocks. My database indicates several prehistoric species swallowed Ooh. stomach stones to aid digestion, <laughs> as well as control buoyancy. They are not attacking us because they have gorged themselves on the meat of the Lusotitan. They're simply Good too to, know. to be aggressive. The Dacosauruses have been fatties. feasting on the Lusotitan for days now. We know from previous scans they have very powerful jaws. Let's determine just how powerful they are. Scan all highlighted Dacosaurus bite marks on the Lusotitan's oh. carcass. <laughs> I thought he was about to say, Scan all these motherfuckers' mouths. I was not going to be happy about that. Alright, so we're doing bite marks, huh? So I need that guy. Ooh, man, that is a big bite mark. I would not want to be on the wrong end of those jaws. Uh, hey, buddy, how's it going? Can you go somewhere else? Good lord, how did you manage that? <laughs> really only two bite marks come on scan bite yeah there is more where's the other one? Oh my god why does my view keep getting off center okay ha there it is And done. Exciting. Oh, yeah. The Dacosaurus's powerful jaw musculature allows them to lock into prey, rip off their flesh, and quickly swallow it whole. No chewing required. In fact, that would be we why should they see it stones. for ourselves. Let's see if we can't help open their appetites a little. Fortunately, I have just the tool for the situation. 
Eight, fire the projectile directly at any living organism to make it appetizing to all nearby creatures. Use the bait on the lone Lusitan meat chunk to attract a Dacosaurus. Where? Oh. Okay, so I need that. Is that right? No, I need that. Yes. Whoops. Whoopsies. Sort of fucked that up. Okay. Did that do it? Nope. Good lord, how close to this thing do I need to get? How about that? <laughs> how am I messing this up? There. Got it. Ooh, what was that? What happened? Oh, oh god. god. Not slender. <laughs> this data confirms <laughs> our scans were correct. They do not mess around. Look, Titanites. No, they, <laughs> they must be interested in the Luso Titan's carcass too. Titanites are likely prey for Dacosaurus. Oh, wow, scared the crap out this of me. This Luso Titan's carcass has provided many unique <laughs> research opportunities. I would expect Dacosaurus to attack Titanites on sight. But we know that they've gorged themselves. That said, the Titanites seem remarkably undeterred by the presence of such predators. What could cause such confidence? Attach bait directly onto a Titanite to entice a Dacosaurus to attack. And then, observe the event. Alright, nobody creep up on me here. I'm, I'm gonna do something. If I can manage to... What? Got you! Alright! Oh, here he goes! Get him! Woo! That's a surprise! The Dacosaurus allowed the Titanite to escape. <laughs> Let's scan that Titanite. Okay. It's probably the freaking ink sacs. Oh, man. Woo! <laughs> Whoopsies. Is that what I'm supposed to do? Nope. That's what I'm supposed to do. Alright, come here. There we go, recenter. And freeze frame. Ooh. Man, you are big. I did not realize how big you were before. The exterior shell was oh, barely man, scratched. That this is likely the reason that the Titanites were so Ooh. undeterred in the first place. It's like a squid in a shell. Uh oh. What's with that noise? What's going on? Oh man. Why are you doing this to me, music? I've played one too many horror games to know. <laughs> Once the orchestral music starts up. <clears throat> Cadet, I have some bad news. Yep. A new Basque of Dacosaurus have appeared. They seem in the mood for live prey, uh -oh. which in this situation uh -oh. means. Uh oh. That uh -oh. Us, uh -oh. way back to the research center. Ooh, we can't okay. unload our data in a post-mortem state. Yeah. Please scan the portal to initiate the transport. All right. Sequence. Well, I'm diving. Okay. So let's go up in this rock formation right here. Let's see if we can regenerate. Maybe they won't come after us. Okay, so they're going after those things. Time freeze! Oh, get out of here! <laughs> okay. Yes, go! Suck a fat one! I'm out of here! Oh, God, why is there gotta be one right there? Ah, oh, man. Ooh! Ha! 
Yeah, yeah, you face hump that wall. Yeah. No, no. Don't come to me. <laughs> Go that way. There's, there's a big carcass over there. I know you'll love it. It's really tasty. It's only been rotten for a couple of weeks. It's not that bad. All <laughs> systems are now online and operational. Hell yeah. Prepare for temporal relocation in Booyah. three, two, one. Wow. Oh. There we go. Gotta recenter it. I hope that thing's not coming for me. He would get wrecked. If he tried to swim into this thing, <laughs> like flying around me. Good, you're back. Well, hi there. Your latest batch of data was so thorough. Thank you. I know it's time. Talking about. And how is your research Damn. against the virus progressing, Doctor? <laughs> the news is mixed. In the weeks since you left, the International Health Monitor has begun calling it the Jurassic Flu. Mm, the weak? Incorrect. The point is they named it because it's spreading. If I can time travel, why don't I just like come back right after I left? Why would I come back a week later? Than our models predicted. Currents have already uh. traded to Northwest Africa and the Caribbean. One symptom Wait a second. Wait a second. It doesn't even matter. South America from Screw them. As soon as you get a cure, just time travel back to before it spreads and go, boom, cure. Like, Doctor, why are we even worried? All right. <laughs> the cadet must feel it too. We could assign more of my resources to you. I am designed to ensure your success after all. Rob, your research systems are the best we have. The cadet needs everything you can offer. If you want to help me, look after the cadet. Search for the cure. Of course, Doctor. You bought the excellent work. Cool. Glad you're so thrilled. Time travel is both physically and mentally demanding. Even more so with the fate of humanity on the line. That said, do not feel ashamed if you need to take a short break before returning to the past. In fact, I would recommend it. Well, all right then. I think we'll go on ahead and end this one right here. Oh my god. Do I have marks on my face? <laughs> That's the one funny thing about these things. Wow, ring right around your face. But yeah, I'm um, like, seriously, who gives a shit? I mean, let's say that the entire population of the world were to die. We're literally sitting on top of a, well, in and on top of a freaking time machine. Just go back in time. <laughs> Just go back in time a couple of weeks, a couple of months, whatever. And, you know, Pop in and say, hey guys, so, um, you know, shit's about to hit the fan. Give everybody this. Trust me. It'll be good. Good. It's a good idea. <laughs> Not to mention, why the hell, when I come back from time travel, do I come back a week later? That doesn't make any sense. Not to mention, I'm only gone for like 15 minutes, 10 minutes, 15 minutes. But it's a week here? That doesn't make any sense. I mean, if this thing were something like, something different than time travel, and it was... I don't know. Can't even begin to try and come up with that. Um, but yeah, that pretty much does it for this video. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, go on ahead and hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll catch you guys later. Oh, wow, that is terrifying. Uh-oh. 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 Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up. Scan it. Scan it. Uh-oh.
Oh, so yeah, screw that. <gasps> okay! Oh. <laughs> Alright! 